Okay, we're back with playing Zelda 2 The Adventure of Link, and we're now at the boss of the Sixth Palace. This boss's name is Barba. He is very dangerous, and it's very hard to defeat him. Especially considering I have no magic. I'll just pop out of one of these, shoot fire, and then I just need to be patient enough to hit him as he comes up or as he goes down. I have to hit his head, otherwise nothing will happen. Ah, I missed him. You need to get in a little close to hit him. Whoa, 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 whoa. Plus, you can get two hits if you're quick. You bulbagi you wanna be. Come on, one more hit. Yeah! Yeah, baby! And I didn't even take a hit! Uh, uh. Who's the man? Who's the man? Who's the man? I didn't even take a hit. Finally, the last crystal is in place. I get my final level up. From here on, if I level up any time after this with 9,000 points, then I get a 1-up. Speaking of 1-ups, it's time we went back and collected all of them. Because we're going to need them for the Great Palace. Ha ha ha, you like me now. So, we are go what we're going to do is... We're gonna backtrack a little bit. And hopefully not die along the way so we waste that one up that we got in the sixth palace. Hup. Okay, 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 we're good. Just had to time my jumps there. Plus, now I can see those invisible MOAs. Of course, that means we need to go back through here again. But that's okay. That's okay in my book. I don't mind one bit. You know what? Just for the heck of it. Take that! <laughs> Thunder, baby! Thunder power. Alright. Hey, look at that. I actually have enough to cast two thunder spells if I wanted. So, just to make things a little easy... A little easier on me, at least. Once all the enemies are on the screen on this one, I'll just eradicate them. <laughs> oh, godly power is awesome. Alright. BAM! Goodbye. <laughs> Alright, so now we just toot the whistle again. Now, like I said, I could be heading straight towards the Great Palace here and now, but there's just a few things I'd like to get before I go. And that's pretty much as... Th those few things are pretty much as many chances as I can possibly get. This is what I've been saving all those one-ups scattered about for. I'm quite sure there's maybe one or two more scattered about in the overworld, but these are the two that I absolutely know about. So, first, we're just gonna go this way. Across this forest. Just walking through, walking through, and there's one one up. One down, one to go. Like I said, I'm... I... Ah, that's helpful. Well, that's helpful. Thank you, Miss... Thank you, Miss Fairy. I think I might want to recharge my magic before I head over to the Great Palace. That's, def that's a definite yes. Because while it is fun to eradicate those Lizalfos in that one area, it's not a valuable idea if you want to survive. So, for now, 
Now we just head back towards East Hyrule. Via raft. Now we just need to go across the graveyard down here. Like I said, I think there might actually be one other one-up, but I'm not quite sure where it was. No. But the ones that I do know about will come in handy nonetheless. There's the other one. You need to be very careful with these one-ups, because these do not replenish. So, that's why I've been saving them all up for this point. It's been so long since I've been in the Great Palace. But, unlike the Sixth Palace, I actually remember my way through the Great Palace pretty easily. Okay, so now that we have the most amount of lives I can possibly garner at this point, we are going to stop by, recharge my magic and health, then we're gonna head towards the Great Palace. <sighs> this has definitely been a very challenging adventure, that's for sure. Alright, that's what I mainly need. Yep. We're almost there. Almost at the end. Do this all just for what? To wake up Zelda's ancestor? I mean, huh? It, it, I don't know, it, it, that just doesn't make any sense. You see, the Zelda that's asleep at that altar is actually a Zelda from the past. See, that's why it, if he actually read the story to this game, then that would it would kind of make a little more sense. But basically, the one sleeping at the altar is the Zelda is a Zelda from the past. You could pretty much say it's Zelda's great 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 grandmother or something, for all I know. <laughs> and yet, I'm waking her up. Why is the question? I mean, I can understand doing going through all this to get the Triforce of Courage and all, but. <laughs> Why wake her? Why do all this just to wake her up? I don't get it. I just don't get it. Ah, uh, well, I'm sure there are many theories as to why, but I'm not going to question him. Why would I question Link's motives? gotta get through with the least amount of damage as possible. Thankfully, one good thing about the Great Palace is that once you get there, then uh, if you happen to actually lose all your lives and get a game over, then, then the game will allow you to restart there, which is very handy. I don't care about losing points right now, I just want to survive. here. Okay, we're on our way to the Great Palace. Of course, there's going to be some very tough challenges on the way there. One thing, these stupid moas flying around everywhere can easily knock me into the lava. Not a good thing. Oh yeah, and there are some predetermined points that we have to fight. Of course, you can easily skip them by taking advantage of random enemy encounters, but... Come on. Huh? Just to be on the safe side. Oh, I wanted that. Anyways. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Yeah, you got nothing. Leap! There we go. Mother? Oh, looky, new Lizalfos. Blue ones. Yeah, these guys throw clubs. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, whoa! 
Come on, come on, give a guy a break. You know what? Fine. Die. Get out of my way. I didn't take advantage of it. That sucks. Problem, problem! <sighs> whoa, whoa, whoa. That's another problem. Time's up. <laughs>